the dictation will start after 5 seconds the next item of expenditure which has attracted my notice is the expenditure on pension stock as much as 100 crores of rupees have been allotted for payment of pensions and other relief stock. May I once more point out to the finance ministry the hardship which people who have commuted their pension are suffering from stop some of the people who have commuted their pension have had the misfortune to live up to 70 to 80 years and have paid their commuted portion twice and still this government exacts these payments from these commuted pensioners stop. I think the time has come when the finance ministry should look sympathetically at the lot of the commuted pensioners and restore the original pension at least five to six years after they have paid up the full commuted amount stop then i come to that white elephant in our government namely the planning commission which cost us rupees 10 crores stop on a former occasion when i made the remark that our planning commission is the costliest in the world the minister of state for finance said that the french planning commission was as large if not larger and it was as costly as our planning commission stop i challenged him to produce the figures stop he said he had not the figures stop i made some personal inquiries of the french embassy in delhi and they tell me that there is no special staff for the French Planning Commission that the staff that try to implement the suggestions of the French Planning Commission are distributed over several ordinary ministries so that no special cost is incurred on the staff of the planning commission stop why should we not have a planning commission composed of representative experts honorary experts like the planning commissions of other countries experts from industry from labor from the professions from the private sector as well as the public sector who give competent and useful advice on planning to the government stop as at present constituted the planning commission is composed of people who are pledged to one 
social philosophy namely the socialist philosophy because the planning commission and the government plan not for prosperity but for socialism stop if the planning commission is to plan for prosperity if the government or to work for economic prosperity the planning commission should be composed of representative experts from interests which are engaged in the promotion of economic growth stop very often we find in the reports of ministries the phrase that the planning commission has allotted so much money to this department or to that ministry stop who or what is the planning commission to allot sums of money stop it is the government departments that should allot it is the ministry the cabinet that should allot sums of money to this or that department stop that shows the planning commission has become another department of government stop if it has become another department of government then why should it not be brought into the general system of government in the administration made a regular department of government so that it may be made responsible to this house stop now it is a body with power but without responsibility stop it is time therefore that the government made up its mind to make an honest woman out of the planning commission stop then another ministry which attracts criticism is the ministry of housing which is also charged with the solution of the housing problem of this country indicated by the calculations of the planning commission itself in order to place the housing position of india on a satisfactory footings as many as 50 million rural houses have to be reconstructed stop how can rupees 46 crores go towards the reconstruction of even a small proportion of this large number stop i made a suggestion to the consultative committee of the ministry of housing that the government should consider the question of drafting and introducing into parliament a housing law imposing housing obligations upon all employers governmental or private from the center down to the villages stop i was told of certain practical difficulties which stood in the way stop one difficulty 
pointed out by the ministry was that investment on industrial development would be considerably reduced if so much money was spent on housing stock but has the government considered that housing itself is an investment an economic investment stock satisfactory housing would promote the health and strength of the workers and the competitive capacity of the workers would be increased if decent housing conditions were provided stop another objection raised to the drafting and introduction of a housing law by the ministry was that it should increase the cost of production and therefore in an competitive market in a competitive world market we would not be able to sell our steel goods stop this was exactly the excuse raised during the british days that if the wages of the workers were increased we could not compete in the world market stop therefore the wages of the workers had to suffer all along stop 